Last season, James Michael McAdoo was asked to play out of position at the five spot in Carolina's small lineup. The position took some adjustment time for the 6'9 forward, but the Tar Heels had their most successful run of the season during that stretch. This season, McAdoo is faced with another position challenge, learning the three spot on the wing. I think it's definitely, you know, a whole nother um, different, you know, set of challenges. Um, you know, I do slide to that three spot, but it's something that I'm a lot more comfortable with, I would say, than playing the five spot just because I like, you know, being on the perimeter. Um, not that I don't like being down on the block. So um, it's definitely been something that, you know, let's hold some I worked on, you know, anticipated and definitely, you know, uh, I'm embracing it, you know, as it happens, you know, and just really still trying to learn, you know, and practice, watching film, and then, you know, the next step will be in the game. The junior from Norfolk, Virginia, spent a lot of time this offseason working on his ball handling to cut down on turnovers and aid in his move to the wing. While McAdoo still anticipates spending most of his time at the four, he thinks the transition to the three is going well. I feel great, you know, um, the coaching staff and my teammates have helped me a lot, you know, on the plays, sets, where to be. And uh, but a lot of it, you know, has come back to me just from past experiences when I was in high school and playing on the perimeter and stuff like that. I feel like also playing at the three spot has really um, made me uh, enjoy playing the fourth spot a lot more and uh, actually got me a lot more comfortable there knowing that I can switch positions and you know play three, four, and five. McAdoo's position flexibility this season will allow Carolina to utilize its front court depth. The addition of freshman Kennedy Meeks and Isaiah Hicks along with the development of Joel James, Bryce Johnson, Desmond Hubert, and Jackson Simmons, should give Roy Williams the option of going with a much bigger lineup than last year. I think that's huge, especially with Coach, you know, and us wanting to be, you know, going back to the typical North Carolina basketball um, with two bigs, but, you know, definitely going a little bit bigger. I definitely think it helps on the offensive and defensive boards, you know, first off. Um, just being able to dominate those and get extra, extra possessions. Um, and then just being able to punish teams inside, get them in foul trouble.